Very odd. Very odd. Okay, next. Um, so you know who Greta Thunberg is, right? Thunberg? Thunberg, you know her. Yeah, oh, yeah. I, I Listen. Mm-hmm. Okay, this may not be a popular opinion with Gre- Greta Thunberg, but I think she's 40. <laughs> like, no kid is that passionate about the environment. Granted, she's doing good things. She's bringing awareness. She's also making millions as a public speaker. You know, er- early on, she did some interesting things on social media that got attention for her cause, which is a great cause. And then she sort of became famous. She's basically the face of, of climate change activism now, let's be honest. And so now that she's famous for it, it's like anything she says gets scrutinized and, and you know. You know, and she's still an adolescent. How old is she? Oh, let's see. I think she's like 17, 18. So the reason I bring it up is she was at a, um, let's see, she's 20. She's 20. So think about this. She's a 20-year-old environmental activist that is immensely famous around the world. She mm-hmm. can't have a normal childhood because if she were to hook up with a guy and they would have intercourse and afterwards he takes off his condom, she'd be like, where are you going to put that? Are you going to flush it down the toilet so it ruins the environment? <laughs> Recycle that. Reuse it. Uh, you want me to do it again with you? <laughs> She'd be like, you're not going to call me? How dare you? I, I, I that she's four years old. <laughs> well, um, she there's a protest in Germany um, because they want to start a new oil drilling thing to get mm. independent of Russia, and she went there and she got arrested. So she's in jail right now. She's in jail. Mm-hmm. What did she? What did she do? She chained herself up to like the wall or something like that. Yeah, basically. Yeah. <sighs> Actually, I think it's like a cave, and I think they went so far in that the cops and rescue basically couldn't safely go in there. It took a long time. They finally got the people that were in there, and yeah, they're going to jail. Okay, listen. Maybe I'm like an old man, but at some point, I would love to look at this young woman and be like, get drunk. (laughs) Get high. Have some fun. What do we do? Live. Yeah. Like, be a kid. Eat some fossil fuels. Yeah. Eat a burger. Toss the wrapper. Go have uh, unprotected sex with some guy. Get mono. Live, you fuck. <laughs> I, I, I just have the idea of like, uh, like, you know, I just feel sorry for it because anyone like, hey, what do you do for fun? What do you do for fun? I tried to stop oil companies from trying to make billions of dollars. Like, holy <laughs> crap. I was going to hope you were going to say, I don't know, you have a Pinterest account or something. <laughs> <laughs> She's just so like, like oh, man. At some point, she's gonna. I wonder if it's gonna. There's gonna be a scandal with her because we're gonna. We're basically watching her grow up before our eyes. But she's just. What if she wants to like cut loose and just have some good times? Like think about the Obama kids, right? Remember when they caught them smoking cigarettes or having weed or whatever like that? I don't blame. I'm that like, was much of a scandal. No, but it wasn't a scandal. But like yeah, they're kids. No, she doesn't have any childhood. I almost feel like she's like almost like. It almost feels like the United Nations made a child to fight climate change or something. I don't know. You know, the whole thing with climate change is I think all the science is correct. I do think we ha- are, um, uh, we have missed some opportunities to fix things and uh, we've done some permanent damage that will actually be very hard to undo. And so we should be alarmed in that way about it. But on the other hand, I don't think most people are going to notice in their everyday lives. So it's like, it's the kind of thing where it's, it's a tricky thing because if you're too alarmist about it, mm-hmm. then people is, uh, accuse you of boy who cried wolf or making it up, which right. the right wing does a lot. And yet... Um, the the truth is that you know they're they're like the global temperature has risen. It mm-hmm. it has been determined for sure. It's caused by human beings. Mm-hmm. So I I don't I don't didn't know. Didn't they say the Antarctica? Answers. Like didn't they undo a bunch of like uh, global Pro- warming? Problem up there. Oh, undo? I don't know about that. But what's really yeah, interesting it's, up it's there gonna is, go back to normal in like forty years or something. I hope so. Yeah. When the tundra, which is like frozen Earth, of course, when it thaws, mm-hmm. there's all of this super old like thousands of year old like worms and stuff in there that now start rotting. So you, like the tundra starts rotting because it's been frozen and preserved Ooh. for all this long. It gets it gets nasty. Uh, new bacteria and, and viruses uh, pop up. So it's really not great. Or the next discovery, the next cure. <laughs> Maybe yeah. that's what's going to come out of the tundra. 